It's rare enough to hear a presidential candidate interrupted and criticized to his face. Rare still to have it come from a member of the mainstream media. Rarest of all to see that candidate resume the battle while cameras roll. But in our fourth story in the countdown, this is all exactly what happened to Willard Mitt Romney today. Governor Romney speaking at a Staples store in Columbia, South Carolina, when the Associated Press reporter Glenn Johnson called BS on the claim that he is not tied to Washington nor to lobbyists. I don't have lobbyists running my campaign. I don't have lobbyists that are tied That's to my... That's not true, Governor. That is not true. Ron Kaufman is a lobbyist. How He's can not... you say you don't have lobbyists Did you hear what I said? Did you hear what I said, Glenn? You don't have lobbyists running your campaign. I said I don't have lobbyists running my campaign, and he's not running my campaign. He is one of your senior advisors. He's an advisor, and the person who runs my campaign is Beth Myers, and I have a whole staff of, de of deputy campaign managers. And has Beth and Myers been on the plane with you? Beth That's Myers is, it has been on the plane with me, and Beth Myers is running my campaign. <laughs> Absolutely. Do so I know Ron's just there as window dressing. He's a potted plant on Ron, the plane. Ron is a wonderful friend and advisor. He's not paid. He's an advisor like many others, um, but I do not have lobbyists running my campaign. Glenn, I, I'm appreciative that you think that's funny, but, but Ron Kaufman is not even in the senior strategy meetings of our campaign. So, so we don't have a minute. Who does, who does have lobbyists running their campaign by that definition? Excuse me, excuse me, Glenn. He is not in the senior strategy meetings of our campaign. Was he in debate sessions at all? Any time? He's never at in any time? Has he ever been at a debate session? Sure. Is, is that, that a senior strategy, strategy meeting? Is that a strategic? Is that a senior strategy meeting? We're going to take, we can take one more no. question, then we have to let, let, me, let, me go back, let me go back and complete the point I was making. I, my campaign is not based on Washington lobbyists. I haven't been in Washington. I don't have lobbyists at my elbows that are, that are arguing for one industry or another industry. And, and, uh, uh, and I do not have favors I have to repay. Uh, to people who've been in Washington for years, nor scores I have to settle. And I'm going to Washington to make things happen. And, and somebody doesn't put the kind of financial resources that I put into this campaign and the personal resources I put into this campaign in order to do favors for lobbyists. I'm going to Washington to help the American people. And that's what this campaign is all about. And that's when Eric Fernstrom, Romney's communications director, called an abrupt halt to the event. But wait, there's more. It seems the candidate wanted to pursue it a little further. Instead of leaving, he turned around to confront Mr. Johnson, getting visibly angry but smiley before his press guy weighed in again. He's not running my campaign. He's not running my campaign. He's talking to make strategic decisions. He's not campaign. running my campaign. Okay, Glenn. There is Glenn. another lobbyist involved in your senior management, too. Listen to my words. What? Listen to my words. I that's, said, that's semantics. So running your campaign that and is giving a you word. advice? Come on. He's on the plane. Hey, Glenn, let's give you arguments for, for that. Okay. Let's let's talk. Let's you and I talk. I'd be glad to talk anytime. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Being argumentative with the candidate. No, he shouldn't All right. stand there. It's out of line. Total falsehood. Oh, so, so now he's now he's now he's telling total falsehood. Save, save your opinions. Save your opinions. It's not an opinion. It's a Save your opinions. Fact. Save your opinions. And is act professionally. Act professionally. I am Don't be argumentative with the candidate. Eric, can I ask you a question? Eric. I think you're rude and ugly. Charming. About an hour later, on board the campaign plane, we understand that Mr. Romney walked back to the press section and, still smiling, told Mr. Johnson, quote, a little later, come on up. Sure, that went well. As to Johnson's claims, while the Romney campaign contends that Ron Kaufman is just an advisor, NBC News characterizes him as a senior strategist who often travels with the governor and advises him before debates. Kaufman also lobbies for Dutco Worldwide, one of the biggest lobbying firms. He's not the only lobbyist aiding Team Romney. Barbara Comstock, who lobbied for Blank Rome and spearheaded the Scooter Libby Defense Fund, is also a senior Romney campaign advisor. Lesson, when it's Staples, smile, buy some Post-its, and get out. Speaking of Washington ties, Senator McCain is dropping hints that Senator Joe Lieberman may be more than just a good friend and campaign trail buddy. He could be his running mate because, you know, that worked so well for Al Gore. While Lieberman has not said whether or not he's interested in the position and said he is not, in fact, his continued presence next to McCain in Michigan and New Hampshire had already sparked rumors of a vice presidential possibility. Rumors fueled when McCain told supporters at a South Carolina steakhouse that, quote, he'd be a great partner in any endeavor, including joining America together. Great. Nowhere near a front runner, and already we're hearing about Veeps.